Hi everybody, this is Eric Folks, Mobile Learning Specialist for Lampasas ISD. Just here to show you how easy it is to grab and share a QR code that will take users directly to a Padlet that you've created. First thing I'm going to do is go to Padlet.com, log in, and I can do this with an existing Padlet, but I'm going to just create a new one. And it gives you various themes, the ability to title it. So I'm going to just adjust my title here. Then I can go to Next. OK, so this is just the initial setup of a Padlet. So there are lots of different options and features that I'm not going to address. We're just targeting the grabbing a QR code and adjusting our share settings. You can see by default it's secret meaning anybody who has the link or the QR code can access the Padlet. It's not going to require any sort of sign-in um, like it would if I had set it to private or any sort of password if I had set it to password protected, but it's also not searchable. Uh, it's not going to be discoverable under a standard Google search and those kind of things. So generally you want to leave it on secret uh, if it's going to have any sort of student work on it. Uh, that way you can put a direct link to it if you want on your website, but it's just not out there wide open. Um, for anybody to just come across in a standard Google search. So uh, by default it's going to be set to secret. Anybody with the link or the QR code can access it and by default they can write on it as well which is exactly what we want the ability for users to contribute to it. So I'm going to say next again and start posting. Okay. So I went through some of that uh, initial setup, but if it's an existing Padlet or even after you've just created a Padlet to grab the QR code, what you're gonna do is click on Share, and then Share Export Embed, and there it is. Simply right-click on it and save the image as and title it whatever you want to to keep track of this QR code. I would recommend probably renaming it with um, uh, Padlet in the name of your Padlet that the QR code links to. But from there you can print it out. Students can scan it with any standard QR scanner. You can also post it on your website as well. Um, whatever you want to do. It's that simple. Have a great day and let us know in curriculum if you have any questions or need any help with this. Thank you.